Hello, good morning and welcome to the Daily Buzzings here on Buzz50.com, the social site for seniors, those of us who are over 50. It's Saturday the 16th of June 2012, we're here in England, it's summer, nope it doesn't look much like it, and this is the first of our outside broadcasts. The Daily Buzzings here on Buzz50, we look at what's going on on the site, maybe a little bit of news, maybe a bit, oh no, always a bit of weather and a few site announcements. First thing, why are we here? Well, it's like uh, two things in one. Firstly, we're going to do some outside broadcasts. Secondly, we're doing a relaunch of our Place of the Week. We started the Place of the Week a little while ago and then I never repeated it the following week. From now on, hopefully each weekend, Saturday or Sunday, we'll start off with a new place. Today, for those of you that know me, no surprise, we're here in Coles Hill, North Warwickshire, a small market town, 100 and odd miles north of London and about 90 miles south of Manchester. Lovely little town, beautiful couple of rivers, one here down by the River Cole. We've got another one, the River Blythe, about uh, half a mile away. Plenty of pubs, restaurants and fortunately, for those of us that live around here, plenty of employment. We've got quite a few um, big uh, employers. We've got BMW factory here. If you drive a four-cylinder BMW or a Mini, your engine was probably made about a mile away from here. So that's Coles Hill. If you want your place to be place of the week, let me know. Um, if I can get there, I'll come along and have a look. If it's too far away, then maybe we can look at some videos and a few photographs of it. I'll put a forum topic on, uh, we'll do one obviously for Coles Hill this week and then we'll hopefully run one each week and the idea is you can post various things, if you find things out about Coles Hill, post them on there, comments and so on. Next up on the list, another feature that we're going to do starting probably today, maybe tomorrow, is buzzers from around the world. About half of our members are from the UK, the other half are from all parts of the world, primarily, as you can probably guess, um, Canada, Australia, the USA. Uh, we've got one prominent member who lives in Germany, in fact I think we've got a couple, and all over the place. The idea of that, I'll post something on the forums, I won't bore you with it too much now, but the idea is how many people, how many buzzers can you find from how many countries, how many different countries from around the world. But I'll post more about that afterwards. Another thing that we're looking at is the new EU cookie law. Cookies are the things that are placed on your computer so that when you come back to a site like Buzz50, that the site knows who you are and what your preferences are. There's new laws about that. I'll be popping something on hopefully later today, letting you know what uh, we're doing about it here on Buzz50 because we've got to comply with the law. Little bit of news, a couple of things I noticed this morning, three things actually. Um, acrobat Nick Valender, if that's right, if I'm saying it right, has tightrope walked across the Niagara Falls. Unbelievable feat, there's a video of it um, on the BBC website, I'll put a link to that. We've got the River Cole here, it's maybe about oh, 30 feet across, uh, maybe I might try that one day if I get enough sponsors. Um, Maybe it's a tightrope walk, or maybe I'll walk across that bridge down there. Depends. Uh, I don't know how risky I'm feeling on the day. A couple of other news items. Um, the idea of the news items is if you hear it on here, if you want to start a forum topic up, start it up and then we'll talk more about it. First female Chinese astronaut about to go up. I know there's been female astronauts from other countries, but this is one from China. And the question is then, and maybe a new forum topic is, um, who, which woman do you respect from the past? Maybe, uh, this is a woman who's done something perhaps internationally you known, perhaps we'll all say we respect our mothers, but then that might get a little bit repetitive. Um, I respect my mother, of course. Um, the Queen's Honours List, uh, here in the UK we have Queen's Honours List, comes out, I think it's a couple of times a year, correct me on that if you like. Um, uh, Kenneth Branagh, the actor, well known for Shakespeare uh, productions, but also uh, as uh, a teacher or, or somebody in the Harry Potter films, he's going to be Sir Kevin Branagh. Plenty of other well known people, plenty of not well known people as well. Do you know anyone who you think should be knighted, made an OBE, MBE, CBE? Do you know what the difference is between OBE, MBE, and CBE? I don't. Uh, Euro 2012 is going on at the moment. 
and England won last night. Sweden 2, England 3. Fantastic. Did you watch it? No, I didn't either, but I'm pleased that we won. The weather, we always round up with the weather here. You can look around, you can see what it's like. It's a little bit dull. The birds are singing. Yep, so they quite like it. It's going to be blustery, showery, maybe even more rain. Um, I think Tuesday is going to be a bit of a sunny day, but nothing too exciting. So thanks for watching. Hopefully see you again soon. If you're not a member, if you're watching it on Buzz50, if you're watching it on um, YouTube, then come along to buzz50.com. We really are friendly, totally free to join, and it's good to be in the company of other people similar to yourselves. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.